So it says May 4th on the calendar, and of course, that's a big deal for Star Wars fans. It's May the 4th be with you, the unofficial Star Wars day. So let's talk to a local small business built partially on the Star Wars empire. That would be Jeff's collectible empire in Littleton. Aiden Erickson joins me now. Aiden, tell us about your Star Wars collection. How many pieces do you have? Well, uh, we have a, we have a pretty countless amount, really. It changes from day to day. We get new stuff in. We sell stuff. It's... It's really fascinating because we never know what's going to come through the door. So we really just see some amazing pieces day in, day out. So you buy and sell pretty much anything Star Wars and have some pretty fancy or collectible collectibles. Yeah, pretty much. We've seen some pretty amazing stuff here. I mean, we get graded figures in. We have seen some really high-end collectibles, like some of the really expensive pieces like Jabba's sail barge or, you know, any of the any of the pieces that are just really expensive and sought after by collectors, you know, just stuff you don't see every day. So really it's, it's pretty amazing. What do you think it is about star Wars that has made such big and lifelong fans of people? I think star Wars really strikes a chord with people because of how universal it is. And of course, you know, people grow up with it. They're nostalgic with it. It's just a great story and there's a great mythos surrounding it. You know, there's, ton of toys, action figures, movies, books, whatever. There's something for everybody in it. And I think that's why it's so universally appealing. Well, today also gives us the perfect excuse to show an old clip of our morning traffic anchor. That's Jason Luber and our morning meteorologist, Lisa Hidalgo, doing battle for galactic supremacy with lightsabers. That clip from just a few years ago. Jeff's Collectible Empire expecting quite the busy day. Aiden Erickson, thanks so much for the time. May the 4th be with you. And you as well.